What's good, YouTube? Don't forget to subscribe. You're living that double R life. It's Skins from CNC Miles. Don't forget to like the video. I'm not even gonna hold you up. Let's get right into this video. Down, one to go. Look at both the drills here. See, you ain't gotta have a garage or have an excuse that you don't got this, that. I'm using bare minimum tools. You know, they go one hole, they go the other one. I just finished this one right here. I'm on top of the oven doing this. You know what I'm saying? Look. This is, this is an example of what's going on. You see the wire out here? In the bottom, made the hole. You know what I'm saying? I, was, I can't hold it up. Let me try to see if I can hold it like this to give you a better thing how it's going to look. Well, obviously, you know what I'm saying? It's not sticking, but from this angle, this is what it's going to look like. You see, you can't see the wire. You know what I'm saying? This wire is going to come from the back of the other part of the headlight. Like I said, I got one down. I got one more to go. And then, like I said, I'm going to start the rest of the process. Now that I'm done making all the holes, I'm trying to get my prep right. First, I'm going to clean it with some soap. You can grab any soap, Ajax, with the sponge. Clean it up and get it ready. You know, let it dry up. And then, like I said, get ready to prime it and then paint it. Let me get the project different started. Now, I'm just going to dry it out with some bounty. You got a little rag or towel. It don't matter what it is. Make sure you don't leave nothing behind. I just want to get it dry real good, all the little corners. And then I'm gonna take the heat gun and then, you know, hit it with the heat gun at a low pressure. Make sure it's dry before I add the primer. And then it's gonna be showtime, man. So once I add the primer, let it dry, then paint it the color that I want, which y'all will see. You know what I'm saying? Because whatever the background color is when you hydro dipping, that's what the color of your, of your film is gonna be. You know what I'm saying? So. We definitely want to get the background, the color. I just say I was hydro dipping the car, that was red, but the background is black. Once I put the film in here, I just say this is all black, the car's gonna come out black. And I didn't want that, you had to paint it red. So that's basically what I'm doing right now. Like I said, I'm getting there. I'm, your prep is everything, so I'm getting my prep ready, cleaning everything out. So I'm, let me get to that. I'm about to hit it with the heat gun, and then, you know, go from there. So you see, I got my setup right here. I opened up a black garbage bag so I don't get the paint on the floor. I even got the dog's wee wee pads all over the place. So you see, I'm not playing, there's no excuses. It's storming outside. But like I said, I'm trying to find stuff to do in the crib. That's why I'm showing you step by step because you will make mistakes if you don't pay attention. A lot of YouTubers skip stuff. I'm not skipping anything, you know what I'm saying? Bad enough, I'm using, I'm using bare minimum tools. With the stuff I did holes with, it wasn't supposed to be no drill. You know, a special machine for that, but it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I'll cover up the um, mistakes with, with the um, what I'm about to do right now. So, let me put the paint down on the ground. We got one hand. So, I'm gonna hit it with the primer, let that dry, and then hit it with the white paint. You know what I'm saying? A few times, give it a few coats, and get it how I want. So, let me start putting the primer on here. He's done already. Put the can like this, and then. Matter of fact, I'll put the can like this. You know what I'm saying? The can is cold. So, hit it with the heat. Get it warmed up. You gotta have um, the paint and everything. That's, I think it's 55, I'm assuming. I cannot remember, it's been a minute. I read this in the back. I think it's 55 degrees and up is the best time to paint. Even though I'm indoors, the can is cold as hell, so I'm gonna heat it up real quick. Gotta prep the can too. It's all about that, man. I'm gonna skip the stuff. You can't just paint it like that. But when I'm done, it's gonna, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna come out how I like. If not, I'll do it over, but that's that's what I'm aiming for to get it done on the first, the first shot. So, I said, let me finish heating this up. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you what I'm priming it, and then I'm painting it. Alright, get this coat on its way. I'm gonna spray it in the motion. Make sure you get the um, make sure you get the primer everywhere. Get enough on there. That's it. Spray a little more. 
Make sure you get it all on there. It's a little bit too much, but it's good enough like that. Let it dry, and then show time for this paint. I had to heat up the can with the heat gun. So I'm about to do my first coat. Let me spray right here. Make sure everything's good. There you go, everything's good. So here's for the first coat. I'm not gonna go too heavy on it. Make sure I just hit all the spots, some white spots. And move on to the next one. Yeah, I haven't used this, this can in a minute. It looks stiff. Might have to hit it with some heat. You know what I'm saying? On the tip right here, the, the tip of the thing is kind of stiff. And it's spraying. It's not comprehending with me how I want to. I'm gonna leave it a light coat like that. For the first one, I'll probably do like five. Let that dry up and then um come right back and hit it up again. All right, I'm on coat number five right now. I'm about to do it right now. You can see how it's turning out. You know, the same process. I don't need to just keep showing you the same thing. You see when I put the first cone on there, I went light. Now I'm starting to go a little bit heavy, so let me uh, show you real quick. Just the last coat, number five. So I get it everywhere. On this angle, hit in every angle possible. And get the little corners. You know what I'm saying? So that's about it for that one. I'm gonna hit this one up and then go to the fogs. Gotta prime the fogs and do the same process. All right, I'm done. As you can see right there, how they came out. Finished with the fogs just now. As you can see, came out pretty good. Let me flip these. Flip these, you can get a better look on them. Boom. Looking real good. This one looking real good. As you can see one time again, headlights looking good. Looking good, it's three in the morning, been grinding all this time, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna let that dry overnight, like I said, then see what they looking like in the daytime and then see if I need to fix any corrections. If not, we're gonna get to the hydro dipping. I was doing so much in my day that I almost forgot to um, record. I'm on my second coat right here, as you can see. These are the side markers. See the red and white paint. And with a red one, that's why you see a red right there. You know what I'm saying? Got my little Pepsi, my music. Pepsi sponsored me, you know what I'm saying? You know, I love that Pepsi and ice coffee. But look how the side markers is looking. Red one and a white one. So you see what's coming with these headlights, the combination. I'm just doing a whole bunch of custom stuff, so stay tuned. All right, so what I'm gonna do is remove these screws. And I gotta send this um, glass to get lasered up so I can get the, um, the decals on there. I, I was actually going to um, put them on top, but that's not the proper way to do it. So I got to take these off, which is, like I said, four screws, and then send it out, which I'm going to do now. One week later. So I just got my demon lenses in the mail. You know what I'm saying? It's been a, it's been a week. <laughs> you know what I mean? So they're right in here. I'm not going to show you them. You know what I mean? I'm not going to show you them. I want you to see it and give you that, that, that wow effect while when it's in the car when I finish them. Um, Installing everything. I was just waiting for these, and um, I was waiting to fin finish hydro, hydro dipping the um the headlights. Like I said, you're gonna see that on the next video. I, I, like I said, I want you to see, you know, I want you to see it all at once. I don't want you to see me doing a the hydro dip, but theme I'm doing because it's not gonna give you the wow effect. It will do. It will give you the wow effect, but not all the way. So I want you to. Just, I just wanted to be a surprise. So y'all definitely gonna see that. And um, well, y'all even though y'all see y'all see me prepping it, but I want y'all to see it on an actual headlight. How it's gonna look. One thing is seeing the film. One thing is actually on the headlight. So let me get this done. Let me wrap it. I mean, let me open this up and see what it's looking like. Start installing Demon Eye RGB on it and everything else. I can't wait to see it, man. All right. All right. So right now we're wiring up the headlights. And we're gonna see how this controller works. Right now we're working with the Ghost controller. And pretty much everything is generally the same. You know, you have the harness here, hooks up to the controller, sensor this box, and then I have positive and negative 
somewhere around here, right here. Positive and negative. But let them know the common situation that's going on with these ghost yeah, lights. Yeah, here's, here's what I'm going through right now. So basically, this wire, it goes to the control box. You see it's the control box? You see on the box, there's positive and negative. One is for output, so this is for the headlights, and this is input from the battery. Mm -hmm. All right, so my current situation here is, where is that, where is that? Uh, yes, this positive and negative went to the actual controller. This is the controller that lets you do all the functions. Positive was screwed into the ground because you have to screw it in to tighten it in. Oh. Positive was in the ground and ground was in the positive. So they sent it to you like that? They sent Wrong. it to me like this. <laughs> Wrong. Yeah, so. I was going crazy. You, you can tell them. I was going crazy. I was like, what the hell is going on? I hooked everything up and I was like, yo, it's not making sense. So right now I'm going to put the red into the positive. Literally red is always positive. Yeah, <laughs> like, let's be real. Red is always positive. So I'm gonna put the red into the positive, black into the ground. I'm gonna see if I can connect to the controller, and I'm gonna take it from there. Okay. But, but like I said, before we uh, you start doing that, like I said, yeah. when you get the ghost controller, you order from Lightning Trends, always open a box, because you might connect everything right and it still won't turn oh, on. Oh yeah, that's correct. Yeah, so prior to this, um, you know, I looked out the instructions online. They, get, they hand you this instruction book right here for the ghost controller. So of course, the first thing I did was I installed the app. I couldn't find it. This thing is literally not English right here. So <laughs> this thing is literally not English. So I'm gonna put that oh, shit down. Shit. In the video, all they were preaching is that if you can't find the module on the app, chances are your positive and negative is, is, is out. That's literally, they said that maybe like five times in the video. So I'm gonna try it out right now. Positive and negative, like they said in the video, these wires here, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure you've seen it. Like. These wires can control your turn signals, your headlights. So when you unlock and lock the car, yeah. it does like cool effects. Yeah, yeah. I'm I, pretty I, sure you've seen that before. Yeah, we definitely got to put that on yeah. when that so, time comes. All right, so um, I'm gonna put on the positive and negative, and and then we're gonna pick it up when I hook up the positive and negative to the battery. Yeah, and we're gonna see what, what's gonna happen there. We got everything connected, so. We're gonna show you the lights, but we're not gonna show you on the car. We're gonna show you in the car. I know it doesn't make any sense, but the thing is, we got a whole bunch of stuff going on with the car that y'all gonna find out probably after the new year. Not probably y'all gonna find out. So like I was saying before I got really interrupted, y'all gonna find out after the new year, sorry, I'm getting a lot of text messages, what's gonna go on with the car. So all the brand new stuff that I'm putting on the car, it's pointless to putting on the car when the car is sitting out here dirty, we're working on it, just to put new stuff, just for it to get old. So whenever I'm doing, whatever I'm doing, once I put that on the car, it's gonna look wore out. So it's pointless. But as long as y'all get to see the, what I'm doing, y'all gonna have more or less an idea once I put everything together. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's, it's important. First of all, it's important. If you, whenever you're setting up lights like this, for example, when you're setting up lights, it's important to test it out first. Before you put it on the car. Like, imagine taking off a front bumper and you hook everything up and shit don't work. Exactly. Then you gotta return it, you know what I mean? Exactly. So, it's important to test it out first with my method. I have a little yeah. booster pack hey. going on. What's, what's up, man? Hey! That gonna be on the vlog, so don't, you better watch it. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and start the video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, man? 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 Yeah, so like I was saying, yeah, definitely it would suck to take off a, a bumper and, you know, wire it up, make it look all neat just for it to not work. Yeah. So it's important to test it out first like we did now. So he's going to go ahead and show you guys what we just accomplished because this is a game changer. It definitely is a game changer. So game changer. you want to you 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 hit him with that countdown down to five? Yeah, I'll get him with that countdown. Five, four, three, three two, two, one. one. It's showtime, baby. Hey, yo, Block, we've been doing this for a long time, beloved. Niggas tend to forget that BV was the movement. We put a lot of niggas on. But now we moving accordingly. <laughs> Hollywood. Change feeling came upon me. Uh, had to minus some people because they corny yeah, I had to yeah. minus some people who try to con me I moved it calmly, the top is so lonely Never thought success would ever change me But it did strangely Now I look at niggas kinda strangely Gotta remind them that I'm something that they can't be 40 I'm Hollywood And I can be more More haters are more greater than you ever could I'm Hollywood And I can be more 
My brain black feel running off that 52 mindset. Niggas ain't grind yet. 52 mindset means having a hustler's ambition and ambition of a rod of shit. I hope they get a line step. Build myself a nice rap. Reaching out to people who didn't deserve my time yet. People who didn't deserve my lines yet. People who couldn't match my grind yet. They all had a chance to be a part of something great, but that time spent for you, I got no time left. On my grind, so if you try to speak or try to reach, I'm probably in a different time zone. Sorry, but your future ain't in my goals. Create my own path, and yours ain't mine, so. How I look, I'm bound to be the next guy. No more hugs or daps, you're lucky to get ahead now. Building up this podcast. Mm, what else? What else? Clothing line coming. What else we got? Big love, got the videos. Tanks mixing and mastering, Wait, beats right, running. Right. Freestyles in the stash. Hey, block, we got it. Still bodying these songs too. They ain't ready. Blockville here, we that one stop shop, so no need for us to stop you. Stop you. I'm Hollywood, and I can be more. More haters are more greater than you ever could. I'm Hollywood, and I can be more. More haters are more greater than you ever could. All in all, I want you to be able to read the room and understand what I seem to do. Understand, I just need the crew and my family. Uh, I no longer believe in you, cause when I didn't have and I tried to get it and tried unity, niggas didn't wanna see it through. I seen the truth. I try to share and give opportunities. Fuck that, I need a boot. I need the stool left on red if I receive from you. Left on scene, what that mean to you? I'm Hollywood now, you beneath me too. What could you lead me to? Come on, nigga, I'm better than that. I sever the cat. Niggas gon' learn how to veteran act. I got better with that, can't stop the rain, I weather the raps, can't stop the change, y'all the senator that Look how you figure that these niggas is better, we tougher than leather, we rougher than ever, we came to ruffle some feathers, moving too clever, better understand you touching us never, nothing will ever interrupt or disrupt our endeavors, this is an era, block feel we do this together, move this forever, never will you see another do this, I prove this is better, our movements is better, our life is a movie, I move through the pressure, this is my pleasure, the pursuit of the treasure, a nigga ain't done yet, Disconnected, I felt disrespected To you this is projected, it ain't misdirected Expected, am I the only one left? If you met me, you'd hate me, you probably would No peace, so be calm, be good If you were me, you would get it, everybody could Don't hate this, you made this, I'm Hollywood I'm Hollywood And I can be more More haters are more greater than you ever could I'm Hollywood Could. Yeah, y'all can't tell me that ain't different right there, man. That ain't different. That is different. <laughs> that is different. That is different. Like I said, like I said once again, man. A lot of the mods y'all gonna see this this month of December. It's not gonna be on the car because, like I said, it's like putting something on just to push, take it right off. You know what I'm saying? And it might get damaged in the process, so there's no point in putting it. So I wasn't even gonna show y'all. A lot of these mods wasn't even gonna be shown. But I said, you know what? What the hell? I don't even care. I'm just gonna put it out there. Y'all gonna see it in the car, and that's gonna be another crazy video once I put it all together, period. You know what I'm saying? So you got anything to say? Boss returns? They're not ready, man. They're not ready? They're not ready for what's to come. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. One more thing, one more thing I forgot. I forgot, guys. Y'all see I just custom these lights, right? Brand new lights. Guess what? I'm working on another pair right now. I'm working on, <laughs> guys, working on another pair. I'm working on another pair, and I ain't even got these on the car yet. <laughs> <laughs> You're good, <Mike>. What? <laughs> It's Yo, like, it is geez. what it is. I it thought is of something, is, and, and I wish I would have thought of it when I was doing these lights. It was too late. I already sealed it, and it was too, too much time consuming to wait. So I said, you know what? These gonna go in here. But I got something up brewing up my sleeve, man. When y'all see this, man, a oh, whole baby. <laughs> and these are just headlights, man. My headlights gonna shut down a lot of people's cars. Period. It's, it's, it's gonna be game over. Look at this, man. This, it's gonna this, be look game. at this. Y'all already yeah. seen it, man. Y'all already seen what, what's going on here, yeah. man. No, nah, no, nah, they gotta see this one. One more time for the video. One, one more, more time, time for the video. For the video. This, one more time for oh, the video. Oh my, this is his favorite. <laughs> this is my favorite, right? Yeah, here. Man, imagine when y'all see that in a car, man, with the side I got some side custom side models I'm working on too. I have a lot of custom stuff that I'm working on, but it's all about the details, man. It's all about the details. All about the details. I'm trying to tell you, man. When y'all see this, y'all seen the first joint, that was phase one, this is phase two. When this car is done, wait, what wait, wait, we said about May? Yeah, I, I estimate around May, May, June. Yeah. Like definitely this summer. Yeah, I, I'm outside. No, yeah, <laughs> I'm outside. outside. Okay. There, there's no competition. Right? I, I'm yeah, trying the to next tell you. Coming, there's no I'm gonna be I'm gonna be bodying people in a day, even top three in New York. But in the nighttime, I think I think all the way, I'm confident number one at the night. 
I wish I can. I wish I could just name some stuff, but it, you guys gonna have to see. It. Yeah, 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 definitely have to see. Because man. this guy is really fabricating some reels. I, I just listen, man. If I could fit a Ferrari on top of Ferrari and top of a Lambo inside the car and make him <laughs> and make him do burnouts in his car, that's what's just gonna happen. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna make it. Happen. I'm gonna find a way to do it. You know what I'm saying? But if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment. You know. All that good stuff. All that good stuff right there. And turn on your, your lights and notifications so you can every time I post a video like this, you get notified first. And follow me on Instagram, not the bird shit. The link will be in the description below. And you already know my slogan. You got a hemi flaunt it. Wait, wait, hold on. I know. <laughs> wait, hold on. If it ain't a what? If it ain't a V8, what else? We don't want it. <laughs> <That's> it. <laughs>